Hello everyone, welcome back to another fun game night. A night that is revered and... I can't think of the word. But anyways, it's a special night. It's a night that I get to play video games. It's a night off where I don't have to help take care of kids. My wife gets Wednesday nights, I get Thursday nights. So now I'm going to be playing some video games. Once again, just like last week, we're going to start off with some StarCraft and then... You know, after a little while, maybe after one mission or two, depending on how long the missions are. Uh, then we're going to switch over to Heroes of the Storm. But I can't wait. This is going to be fun. So the same thing like last time. I'm going to just do the whole live stream. Uh, separate the individual videos and upload them for individual consumption. So that you don't have to watch whatever... Basically, whichever game you don't want to watch. So... Starting in with StarCraft, where we left was uh, Kerrigan was going to help the uh, humans take over Core Hall. And as you can see, the liberation of Core Hall, we're going to try and destroy all enemy bases. And I think, I think that we're going to be successful. Let's see. Get this back in. Get drones going. Okay, all the drones come here. You guys all come out here. Drone here. We're gonna get this. Uh, let's get our army together in a group. So these guys explode, if I remember correctly, which can be good against banelings or big groups of humans. Actually, move these guys out of the way. Just over here. Get them out. We don't need them. Now, I don't know who we're going to be attacked by, so we're just going to uh, spread them around. And these guys will be number two. One, two, one, two, one, two. It's going to be four, five, and six, just so we get everything going. Um, what's this? So, wait, four, five, six, and we have a seven. Uh, let's see, let's move everything out here. Oh, a nice ultra. Okay, you guys are gonna go up there. As I suspected, the UED has sent its pet Zerg to reinforce their troops. But strangely enough, there aren't very many Zerg attacking. Maybe the UED is having more difficulty controlling the Overmind than I thought. Okay, so that could be good. If we look, we got a Sarlacc pit over here. That's cool. Uh, we do need a gas. Okay, get some more drones up and going. That way we should have the economy that we want. Infested Terrans, they just explode. So I'm not sure we care too much about them. So let's go ahead and get our upgrades going. Attack range. Come over here and build me... No, not that. BV. There we go. Get our upgrade starting. Looks like that's about to pop. Let's go ahead and get some Zerglings going so that we can actually do some offense and defense. What I do like is that we do have a lot of... We, we have a lot of larvae to just get our, our units up and running do a lot of stuff with that. So you guys are just going to go here and we're just going to grab a fourth one to go into the geyser. We'll kind of keep an eye on it and just see if that's enough for us. But we'll see. This will be a lot better once we get speed going. Let's go ahead and just get a lot of overlords so we don't have to worry about it anymore. Especially you. Go ahead and make some more Zerglings since we ran out. Looks like we have two attack paths into our base, maybe a third. Zerglings should be able to be fast now. Okay. Okay, so we're going to be short on gas, so we're just going to build a lot of Zerglings. Looks like we have some buildings over here that we can take care of. 
Move these guys to the side, move these out of the way. Uh, you're gonna be my exploration force, you're gonna come over here. Okay, no, we're just gonna stay here. Looks like we've got some extra Zerg down here. Oh, and some lurkers, look at that. This will be great. Okay, twos, let's go ahead and have you explore up here. Okay. We should be able to upgrade now the other stuff. Watch, we're gonna run into siege tanks or something stupid. Okay. We see something big over here. Looks like a force that just left. Let's go ahead and explore up in here. No, no, everybody coming this way. Okay. Um, so let's go ahead and get an overlord just to get some sight over here and then maybe our hydras can attack it. But I'm thinking we're just going to make a lot of zerglings and send them in as cannon fodder. And then, yeah, we'll just go from there. So let, let's go ahead and our safest one, we'll go ahead and upgrade to a lair. Just so that we can get some more upgrades going. Uh, we might actually want to run up here and attack from this one. Just so that we have a second base available to us. But then we do have to defend two bases, so... If we attack this and then go up here, we should have one choke point that we have to defend. And that's it. So let's send those guys in. And then as soon as those start running, then we'll go one and two. And then we'll just go ahead and send in another group. And we can't do anything. Crap. But that definitely did go my way. Let's go ahead and build some reinforcement zergs to just throw at them. You guys go ahead and defend down there. Okay, we're still far enough away that we don't have our upgrades, which kind of sucks. We should have our links, right? Yep. Go run and attack this, please. So, you guys go ahead and just attack this area. We're just going to clean this whole thing up here. Send these guys to also come attack, reinforce. And this guy's upgraded so we can get some upgrades done. Okay. And let's send you guys to just clean this up. The old switcheroo. What are you talking about? This is what we did last week. Okay, let's pull these guys back just so that we're good and covered. And did we get some more hydras? We did. Okay, so that was successful. We actually did a lot of damage to them. Um, and now we're going to move 4, 5, and 6, and 7 all the way up there. So 2... trying to think of what do I want to attack next. I'm almost thinking down here. Everybody just go ahead and attack down there, have some fun. There's no switcheroo. 
We'll get to uh, Heroes of the Storm later, don't worry. Okay, go ahead and do Carapace. So while they're bringing everybody's attention down there, we're going to go ahead and attack this area. Bring this guy in just so that we have some better vision. In case they have more lurkers. Oh, the lurkers are just ripping them apart. Okay, one, two. Two, let's get this working again. You to man. Okay, so I have a uh, ridiculous amount of minerals, so we're just gonna dump them into these. Uh, we do need to do a queen's nest. VQ, I'm guessing. Okay, I'm trying to think, do I want to wrap around this way or do I want to just go up the middle? I think I'm just going to go up the middle. Get everybody down, off of there. Uh, Ultra this Cavern isn't available yet. But that's fine. Uh, we're not going to attack the bottom anymore because that's just surrounded by lurkers and that's just going to kill us. So instead we're going to send all of these lings into the Firebat territory, which should be entertaining at best. Uh, let's go do this. And this should go down quickly. I do kind of wish you had the queens where you can, you know... I can't remember what the trait was called, but basically you can give life to other units. And actually I wanted to do Overlord Speed, just so that we can use these guys as detectors and speed their vision. Okay... So we built the queen's nest, so now we can upgrade, right? Oh, except we're already researching something else there. Come on. Okay, so we have attacked this. I'm hesitant. I'm afraid that they're going to have lurkers and it's just going to rip everything apart. Two. So let's go ahead and just have these guys explore then. I am running low on gas, but that shouldn't be too much of a problem. Oh, we can actually get another base up and going. That's what we should be doing while we wait. BH, let's get this guy going, and then we'll send this guy, and he's gonna go into a gas factory. That takes way too long. Upgrade our missile attack. We're actually not gonna be doing anything lair wise but we are going to be getting us an ultra list once we can get this into a whatever it is a hive let's go ahead and peek how far are they going to follow me enough that I can get us around no 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 you guys stay our forces are under attack uh, is it time? No, we're waiting for his overlord speed before we do anything. So, you and you, you're going to follow them. Okay, evolution is complete. Let's go ahead and get our hive work in so that we can get our upgrades going. And uh, let's just send these guys in. Just, just an overwhelming force. This is what Zerg's all about, right? Okay, Zerglings, go in there. And that's actually a pretty big force. That kind of sucks. We're going to send these guys in just to keep them all busy. Yeah, you just go after that one. Okay, now we have to send another drone up there to be an extractor again. Not the end of the world. Ok, 
Okay. Hive's not done yet, so we can't actually upgrade those. Okay, and uh, in we go again, just to kill it. And where did our overlords go? Did we lose our overlords? Looks like we did. Not too big of a deal, though. Okay, you guys go over here and start mining. Get a lot of lings that we'll just send in. Two. And all these lings are just going to be cannon fodder. Go ahead, run in there. No, come back, dude. That's right, we did want to get an ultralist cavern, though. Throw some of those out there. We're just killing everything. This is awesome. Hive is done. And now we have the gas. You know what we should do? Is we should just send all these guys into the gas. That way we don't have to worry about it. And this guy somehow survived. So he's just going to go up here and chew apart those uh, SCVs. Okay. Oh, we just need a lot of gas right now. Okay, we do need to start running down south because they're stu they still have a lot of buildings there that need to be taken care of. Looks like they are doing some kind of drop ships. So luckily that doesn't kill me, that just slows me down. So we do have an Ultralist Cavern. We need to spend all of our money on just getting upgrades going. Why do I have Scourge? This is all taken care of. Let's actually regroup back here. And then we're just going to assault down here. I need to clear this out. So let's go ahead and move these overlords over here, just so that we can actually see what we're dealing with. Okay, come on overlords. Make it quick. Yeah, might as well just kill that. There we go. Okay, we're getting there. Game night, since when are you allowed away from your adult responsibilities? I know, it doesn't happen very often, but when it does, I'm responsible and play StarCraft and Heroes of the Storm. So we did have a lot of lurkers over here. Hopefully they can't actually produce anymore. And so I'm just at the point where I can just funnel in a ton of troops. Okay, evolution complete. That means our guys are bigger and stronger. Um, any other upgrades? <clears throat> we'll just make these guys unstoppable. 200, so I can get one out. Okay, these guys need to come in. So we are taking them down pretty quick. Maybe not quick enough, though. Okay, we killed him. Just start chewing on these zerglings. And we need to bring these guys in so we can see any lurkers that are left over here. Ok, 
Okay, Zerglings, go in and have fun. Uh, let's see. Let's just bring you in here. You can keep things busy. Okay, Overlords can come in a little bit. I don't care if the Scourge die, I don't need them. Okay, and that is another base that's cleared out that we can expand to. Okay. Four, five, six, seven. Everybody rallies here. You guys, give me more drones, will you? How are we doing on minerals? We're doing okay. We're doing okay. Let's get some more ultralisks. And, oh, we're just about done with this. So we can actually upgrade. Our lings are really high, and uh, they're really upgraded. So they're going to do a ton of damage. Let's bring these guys down here. Two's up here. Our little scouts. Okay, now we need a lot more hydras. Now that they're fully upgraded. Seven. Oh, let's get some of those in. Okay, so these are going to be our threes. That's what we're going to be running in. Send these guys up here. Who do we miss? Okay, we're about ready to get our force up and running to where we can just run in again. It'll be good and fun. Okay. We've got our cannon fodder. We've got our reinforcements. So, let's go ahead and start attacking. Send these guys in. Send those guys in. And then send those guys in. And then where are our overlords? They can come and give us vision. We'll just go ahead and send everything left over here. Just go and take care of all that. And what do we have left over? Just go in there, kill stuff. Go ahead and scout for us, make sure that there's no more lurkers. Have we just killed pretty much everything? We're just tearing everything apart at this point. All forces are under attack. Go in and attack. I've trained you well. Die like cannon fodder that you are. Meanwhile, let's go ahead and make sure. Oh, we do still have an upgrade left. To... Okay, we don't actually want to do that. We want to do this. Send you all here. Uh, you, you're gonna be a pretty new hatchery over here. I'll send you up there. Uh, you're also going to be something nice and special. You're gonna be another gas geyser. So we can actually mine gas. Meanwhile, we're gonna send the rest of you just right into the fray. And the hydralists are just going to clean everything up. Let's go ahead and bring these guys in. And some more zerglings to just help clean everything up. It's okay.
we have an army of Hydralisks coming, so I'm really not too worried. Doesn't look like they have any drones mining anything anymore. Okay, so those Zerglings have spawned, that's great. And then we have all the upgrades done that we, on the units that we actually care about, huh? So we have enough gas that we can dump it into Ultras. And then we can also dump the rest into Hydralisks. That's great. Let's go ahead and send these Zerglings in to go scout everything else so that we know what we're going to kill next. Uh, where are our overlords? We need to get vision. Okay, and go ahead and attack that. Okay, we have full groups. And we do have a bunch of Zerglings and Ultralists incoming. They're just going to take a little while to actually get here. Okay, I see a Lurker over here, so we're going to run over here. Everybody turn around and get rid of that Lurker. Okay. Just bring these guys in. And all of you guys, you're just going to go in. You're just going to kill everything in sight. Okay, you're going to hide with these guys. All you guys, please. Just run in there, kill things. Be good, Zerglings, kill things. That is a fun sight, though. Seeing all the Ultras just tear everything apart. Where's the siege tanks? I'm seeing siege tanks. Okay. One, everybody come here and take out this, please. Okay, and you guys are going to be twos. We just need to kill some things. Okay, uh, we do have the other base up in mining, so let's go ahead and build some drones just to mine here. Get the gas going, keep the gas alive. Our forces are under attack. Okay, let's go ahead and send everybody in again. Do this. I actually want everybody to come here. So we did get rid of that wraith, okay. Okay, so we killed that. I think we've gotten pretty rid of pretty much all of the resistance. 
So we're just gonna send all of these guys. Let's go ahead and kill the Zerg units here. And then I think that's it. Or let's just get all the Zerglings in here. They're just gonna kill everything. Our forces are under attack. Get over here. Okay, we're good. Forces are under attack. Okay, just keep pumping the units, that's all we have to worry about at this point. And once again, we have more Scourge. Gosh dang. I don't know why they keep tapping it. It's very annoying. Meanwhile, we have some more Zergs that can kill things. Zerglings, I should say. And now we have some more Hydras that will actually do the damage that we need. So what's great about Zerglings is that they will destroy buildings very quickly. Which comes in handy. Although we are losing a fair number of them to Widow Mines. Which is not ideal. Who's attacking us over here? Okay, I think we're about there though, destroying their whole base. Is that Valkyrie still alive? It is. Okay, all of you guys, you guys can come here and kill this stuff. Excellent. There we go. We cleaned it up. The UED's defenses are broken. Arcturus, you may take possession of this wall with my blessings. Don't be snide, Kerrigan. This was part of the deal, remember? I've earned this. I am Emperor of the Dominion again. Oh, this is gonna go well. I'll be sending General Duke to establish my base of operations in Augustgrad. I hope you make the most of your reign. Hey, victory! Okay, it's 9 o'clock, so we're gonna be switching over. So we're gonna look at any cutscenes and see what's gonna happen on the next mission that we're gonna do next week. has come to separate the chaff from the wheat. Now that the UED's <coughs> power base is broken on this world, only their forces on Char pose any significant threat to me. It's time to move to the second phase of my plan. Kill Duke and kill what Phoenix? Here in Dang. Oh, my queen. What would you have done with them? They are of no further use to me. Though they have proven themselves useful, it might be dangerous to allow them to live. Without the services of General Duke, Minx will be easy to deal with. But Raynor and Phoenix are uncannily resourceful. <sighs> they must all be eradicated. Cerebrate, I want both General Duke's and Phoenix's bases destroyed. Leave no one alive. My queen, if I may suggest a strategy. Both the Protoss and Terran forces are resting after our previous victory. If we attack immediately, while most of them are asleep and unaware, we can whittle Stab them in the back, that's all you have to do. Clever. How long after our initial attack can we expect them to regroup and retaliate? I'd say in six minutes. That only gives us enough time to launch a surprise attack against one base. But no, Luke. No, I do not have any kids to pay attention to. Not on Dad's night. Not on game night. Failure is not an option. Slaughter them all in my name. Okay, so we're just gonna kill them. We're gonna save our game, our progress right here at the beginning. Like this. And then we're gonna end it. We're just gonna end mission. Exit program. So I'm going to uh, switch to Heroes of the Storm now. So you guys can keep watching. We're gonna keep the stream alive. I'm just going to basically stop the recording on the back end.